pun ni nak. I'm not buried. I'm not My name is Patrick Ivinji. I'm head of PR and engagement for Afrobasha, and I'm here to welcome you all to the first season of Afrobasha, which is going to be headlined by International Artry Court Ali Kira, and uh, with a lineup of local artists, uh, we're going to be performing tomorrow, and we have also another lineup for Jamboree, which is also going to be headlined by an international star. I'd like to say a very big thank you for all of you being here and also uh, for ensuring that you are here on time. We apologize for keeping you uh, waiting for long. On behalf of the partners, I'll start by saying a very big thank you uh, to Ziki Media for giving us the opportunity. Sorry for the interruption. I'll start by giving you a very big thank you to Ziki Media who has brought us the international artists. They have given us opportunity to listen and to uh, hear what all these artists they have to bring to us. The other person I'd like also to say a big thank you is our sponsor, that's Odibet as well. And again, uh, Superior Hotel, which is a whole umbrella of different hotels, that is Lake Naivasha Resort, Masada, Sweet Lake, as well as the Afro Basha, where we are going to hold our first event in Naivasha. So make sure, even on Christmas, after the event is done, you need to visit uh, one of the hotels to see what they have in offering. 
I'd like to extend this opportunity to Felix, who's the regional uh, manager for Ziki, to share a few insights about the event, and then from there I'll share the next program. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. Uh, thank you for creating time and thank you for coming through. Uh, so this weekend, Afrovasha weekend, we have a long weekend at like Nevasha Resorts. Uh, of course, all of you, have, I believe, have seen the lineup. Uh, headlined by Abikiba, we have a uh, number of our artists as well. Arrow Boy, Mutile Brown, uh, Willie Paul. Uh, we have um, different DJs as well, about five DJs as well, to take you through the, the day and the night. Um, of course, being the first uh, the first um, edition of Avrovasha, uh, we want to make it big as we hope that this Avrovasha will be uh, a regular thing. So I'd like to welcome Ali. First of all, welcome to Nairobi. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Thanks, Felix. Thanks, Felix. <laughs> yeah. Before uh, I move forward, I forgot to mention to you that we also have one of our best sponsors called Aura Homes. Aura Homes are the ones who are going to provide the furniture for the VIP seats. So for those of you who are coming to uh, Naivasha, make sure you see the setup of the VIP and make sure you get time to visit Aura Homes. They are just left uh, on Ojijo Road and you can be able to see the amazing things that they do have. So I would like to extend this opportunity to Aura Homes to share some of, you know, I, I don't know what he has to say for now, but I know he has an amazing thing that he wants to share with you. Yes. No, thank you so much. Saseni, I am going to I am going to I am I am Ali. So, uh, my big brother, you know, I am a big fan. Once you are way back. So, sharing stage now. Once I am going to privilege you, I am going to be experience. Wengi mnaenda ku uh, kukumbuka ni inaenda kuwa kwa inaenda kuandikwa kwa vitabu za kumbukumbu so mimi kivyangu kama Aro Boy pamoja na timu yangu tuko tayari na can just wait to no, give you my best so sina mengi ya kusema bila you so much welcome home my brother feel at home thank you eh, twende naivasha tufanye ile kitu <laughs> Yeah. Thanks so much, uh, Aruboy. Tickets. Tickets are available on MTKet, and uh, we are happy to announce to you that as from today, we have a new offering for the ticket. If you want to be in Ivasha for the two days, our ticket sales has gone lower for the regular ticket at 3,000 off, so you can be able to attend uh, for the two days. That's for the regular. Uh, for the regular. And for the VIP, they'll be going at 8,000 Kenyan sheets for two days. So you don't have something, we have something for each and every person. And again, we've got accommodation for all the categories available in Ivasha. So if you'd like to spend the whole night uh, tomorrow and then on Saturday, Sunday and then come back on Monday, then that's catered for and we have different categories. So, ni shukran sana na nigetaka kumpea rukusa. Dugu yetu kutoka Tanzania, <laughs> Ali Kiba, azungumuze venya mejitayarisha hapo kesho ili kutupea shereke, sindio? Eh? Sisi atutakangi kupangwa, tunataka tukuti panga, sindio? Karibu sana, Ali. Uh, asante sana. Kwa nini ulibadisha rugu ya bada kujia <laughs> mwaka? <laughs> Alright, sir, I'm proud to be Swahili, but uh, me ni Swahili. Yo, Ivo, thank you so much, guys. Um, na kwa na frasi kuzote nikiwa na kuja Kenya eh uh, Nairobi coast wapi kokote kule kwa sababu eh uh, siku zote najisikia niko nyumbani umeelewa um, vile vile ningependa tu kuambia uh, this is my um, my first show uh, ya album yangu only one king uh, kuifanya in Kenya so i think it's a uh, it's a good start to me because Babu Naisi Sienda Mbali Niko to Bad around home. Uh, you guys na na Wahidi uh, the way to live na furaha and niko 
kwa kitu ambacho nitafanya it's, uh, it's extra ni extra itakuwa ni vitu extra sana kwa sababu nafanya live performance lakini sijawahi kuperform album yangu itakuwa ni kwa mara ya kwanza inaivasha kwa hivyo uh, vile vile najua mmekuwa na uh, mlikuwa katika kipindi kigumu sana cha quarantine na nini uh, I myself Uh, nilikuwa najisikia vibaya sana nikiwa nakuja hapa lakini kwa saa 4 na tukorudi nyumbani sisi Tanzania tuko na kafi ajapo uh, uh, kwote nikiwa nikikata na watu nasikia pole sasa hivi ni muda kujia kujia kujienjoy kujiachia let's go and do this in Naivasha uh, i believe uh, my fellow artists hapa wa Kenya uh, Aro, na na wasanii wengine ambao watakuwa kuwepo kiukweli uh, tuko na hiyo hamu ya kuwafurahisha watu mmekuwa tumekuwa bored kwa muda mrefu sana so let's forget about it and to enjoy our vp uh, kwa sababu you know we human sisi ni binadamu kama tulikuwa wapweke sasa hivi tujiachie sasa tufungue zile mishipa yetu ya nani ile kama kuna zamani mtu ulikupa na una spread una, una spread nini ako kwa watu ama vitu gani unafurahia lakini sasa ilipokuja lockdown ikabidi sasa utulie basi ile kitu itarudi tu safari this time kwa i'm sure you guys mta enjoy na niko na Zik Media ambao ni partners wangu tunafanya kazi pamoja uh, tumeona tu create hii kitu kwa sababu tu ya ya, ya mapenzi tu ya kuwajali watu wetu Uh, my fans na nini uh, and appreciate you guys uh, kwa kufanya hii pamoja na mimi uh, so naivasha this weekend kila mtu twende huko uh, sisemi kwamba tutakutana tuna watu wa Nakuru na Nairobi nini lakini all Kenyans are welcome kutoka kila sehemu mnaelewa kama kuna watu wanatokea coast na wengine wanatokea huko bara huko na nini wanakaribishwa huko Well, thank you so much. That's all I can say, but I I guarantee you guys kwamba show itakuwa amazing. Uh, I believe in God kwamba mambo yatakuwa mazuri. Naombea kila mtu kila mtu ampe afya. Naombea kwa Mungu kila mtu ampe afya na uzima tukutane na Ivasha. Uh, kwa ni show ya the only one king. Thank you so much. Asante sana. Yeah. Uh-huh. Ingependa eh hakuna makofi jameni. <laughs> Hi, so milango itafunguliwa. Okay. Yes. Kuna <laughs> maswali mawili. Sawa nitakupa nafasi. Nitakupa fursa. Nitakupa fursa. So, uh, <laughs> you guys ni zungumzeni ba. <laughs> Haya. Wengi wenu wanaogiza tutafungua sanga. Ndio. Pale Afro Vasha Lake Naivasha Resort Garden milango itafunguliwa 4 pm saa kumi alafu mkingia pale kutakuwa na zile protocols za MOH guidelines lazima zifuatiliwe alafu kisha ingia utapata mko miandaliwa kuna vendors wa aina zote chakula kinywaji right na wale wengine wa zile vitu mnapenda litakuwa pale hapo Afro Naivasha Lake Naivasha Resort pia ile kitu nyingine ningetaka kuambia ni kuwa hatuna line up ya wasanii wawili wa kesho. Eh? Tuko na nani mwingine? Tuko na Femi One, tuko na Mandi, tuko na Willy Paul wenye watakuwa kiperform hapo. Alafu tuko na DJ wanne including our very own Slava Pali. Slava just with and we their line up of four DJs they will be quite a lot. And again the other person who is going to be the MC for the entire night is Papa Freddy. You know ngamoya ujeni pale mtamuona. Ndio? Haya, ukitaka kununua ticket iko unatumia USD. Tafadhali enda pale Dells star 229 star 89 hash. Hapo unaweza pata ticket, alafu pia unaenda pale M ticket utapata link za kupata regular na VIP ticket. Yes. Ningependa wakati huu wa Otile. Yes, Otile also is performing tomorrow. Sorry, Samani. Otile is performing tomorrow, so again, we've got a very nice amazing lineup for tomorrow. 
and then come January again because we know as Kenya, January is falling on a Sunday and Monday we don't need to have to go and work. Findio? Findio? So, hakuna ati ya urudi Nairobi, wewe lana pale mebasa, tuendele na sherehe on Sunday, alafu mtarudi Nairobi kufanya kazi nini? <laughs> yeah? So, ni hai rote tukonayo for now, mingependa kwa sema shukran kwa kila mtu amekuja hapa na wakati ningetaka kuwapea fursa ya kuuliza maswali yes fursa ni fursa yeah good yes i am yeah and a struggle eh yeah. struggle but it's very good so it's good sawa sawa i tell me na struggle in english i'd like to give you this opportunity to ask questions right just tutambulishe kwa majina kaka yangu pale tutambulishe kwa majina maana natoka alafu tutembee Okay, I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next you think it's going to affect your female uh, partner? Mm. Yeah. And the second oh. question, say uh, Kenya, you are playing uh, most Kenyan music. What's in Jibu, you are playing That's how. Honestly, I'm not supporting that. Because Babu is Jibu. Because he's Jibu, he's Jibu. But, you know, I. <laughs> Ah yeah yeah, me or Sidu you can find it, but yeah. I cannot support that, of course. I would say not much about it. I would say not much. Second question. Yeah. Uh, so you can explain uh, most of the things you are playing. Don't you think it's affecting music in Tanzania uh, market wise? Pia ama pia ata sikuwa wea ya ya pukuwa ni likuwa ni misikia jana. It's seventy five. Um, nice. But you know, it's a kimojo of music. Music ni kama na spirit na niyaki. Music, whatever you are going to do, like in Kikweli, music will want it to penetrate. Ata kama na play, ona chiza kidogo tu. Ata kama na chiza kidogo tu, music uta uta pita. Uta upenda katika music. Me and Labda, let's say a hundred of songs. Uta pick two songs, maybe Don Zuri. Like hizo two songs ziko katika 25%. Ama utapata uh, katika music a thousand ziko katika 60%. Ama utapata yani music ni mziki tu. Mimi sio sema kwa sababu ni rules kama imekuwa hivyo ni rules. Uh it accepted. Lakini like, kiukweli uh, ingekuwa fair zaidi labda ingekuwa 50 and then music ya all the all, dunia nzima iwe pia 50. Kenyan 50 and then the whole world music yote itakuwa na kufanyo 50 that's ok we all, we all play music yote me I don't believe kama kuna hizo percent ya tuna bere yesa hizo tuna play music yote mkali music mzuri itu so yo pia taisisi inatupa inatupa challenge yo sani utengeneza music kwa fresh watu it doesn't matter kwa mba mimi inatokia Kenya or inatokia Tanzania me I sing for people do you understand kwa mziki wangu uta, uta, kama nimefanya mziki mzuri utapigwa kokote hata China. Yeah. So ni nini? Ah, uh, na respect, na respect my fans of Araboy, respect my fans of Tile, and I believe uh, we fans, mimi mwenyewe ni fan wa muziki wa Kenya. Tunapenda muziki. Unajua kuna shabiki na yule mtu uh, wale wa, kuna shabiki na mfuasi. How do you differentiate it? Mfuasi ni nani? 
yule mtu ambaye anafuata yani yule mtu kabisa anamfuata mtu from the beginning from the day one maana lakini washabiki ana hiyo option ya kupenda mziki tofauti tofauti anaweza kupenda arbo anaweza kupenda tile otile anaweza kupenda nyasho anaweza kupenda calligraph huyo ndio mshabiki wa mziki understand uh, mimi najua kabisa kwamba ni mziki mzuri wana mziki wazuri na watafanya kila watu watapenda na wao vile vile wanatengeneza ile profile yao hiyo strong na nini kwa sababu hata mimi mwenyewe uh, naweza kusema mimi ni legend lakini pia kuna challenge nitapokea kesho i believe kwamba kuna kuna wasanii wana skills nyingi sana za uimbaji za kuperform kwa pia ningetamani kuona ningetamani pia kujifunza kutokea pia kwao you understand kwa hiyo natamani kujua kwamba hao boy ana perform vipi uh, Utile ta perform VP eh Will Paul pia atafanyaje natamani nione zile skills za kwenye stage kwa sababu uh, mimi najifunza kila siku Yeah thank you Anaza kasi Haya tunaweza pata swali la mwisho Aha Nini energy drink yes no fire powerhouse yes yes uh Niko, niko na partnership na Mofaya na wa, wa South Africa lakini uh, i powerhouse uh, nimekuwa indoors na indoors nimeelewa uh, naitangaza ni energy drink poa sana uh, nimenifanya mbaga za sasa hivi nafanya vitu very speed uh, msita kuzungumzia Mofaya sasa hivi kwa sababu haiko tayari mpaka sasa hivi kuna vitu viko beyond the scene siwezi kuzungumza sasa hivi lakini uh, uh, powerhouse inafanya vizuri sana na nikinywaji drink poa sana energy drink safi kabisa kwa hindi chamda refu alafu na chukua mwingine kufanya uh, productions na producers tofauti tofauti lakini you have to find a chemistry lazima uwe na hiyo chemistry ndio utengeneze muziki mzuri for, for my perspective na, na ni kitu ambacho naona kabisa kwamba ni Uh, ina work kwangu mimi lakini vile vile lazima nigundue kwamba producers mawe mwanamuziki awe ana uelewa mziki anajua mziki uh, nimefanya kazi na producers of forty forty lakini they must we must find chemistry we must lazima tuwe na hiyo chemistry ili tuweze kutengeneza mziki ambao itautoa kwa watu wakaupenda yeah. sometimes inatokea yeah wenzangu pale alikuwa na swali Dennis Milibo alikuwa na swali pale alafu tufunge sawa sawa haya kwa kini cha kwanza alikuwa anataka kusema kuuliza kama kesho tutapiga live kama tutakuwa na record yes yes na baadhi tukija kushuka tunaweza kujua kama kuna baby good question eh lakini ni kwamba baada ya one one king kuweza kutoka kulikuwa na zile taarifa kwamba kulikuwa na watu wanauza album kule mitaani yes kama kujua ile nishia wapi na kama kuna hatua zileza kuchukuliwa. Asante. Tazuna sasa swali ya kwanza. Swali ya kwanza of course live band. Live band itakuepo. Uh, live band mimi napenda live band. live band hapa Kenya ilikuwa ni wakati wa kuroga 2015. Yeah. Ai zamani. Ah kimi ni mission kwa guys. <laughs> Eh ba I'm sure cash uh, naivasha itakuwa ni hatari sana I believe Mungu atupe uzima uh, na yinyi pia wote tutane huko tuje tu enjoy 
kwa pamoja na about album unajua pale sisi kwa kila sehemu ya wakati wewe unatengeneza hii uweze kupata faida kubwa lakini pia kuna wale watu wa low profile wale wanataka maisha <laughs> lakini kuna kuwa na mtu mmoja tu ambaye anarudi vitu vyote hivi mimi sijatoa CDs so nikaja nikakutana na CDs mtaani hata hapa na I believe ziko watu wanauza hujatoa hata CD mtu ana CD <laughs> what is that <laughs> So yeah, uwezi kukamata watu wote na tukio kumkamata yule mwizi mmoja na produce hizo vitu na supply na nini. But all in all wanaishirikia. Kuna hatua zimechukuliwa. Thank you for that for that question. Thank you so much. Bo, bo. Na fasi moja tu swali kwa Aru tafadhali ili tusiharibu muda. Hai, mimi nitatoka kidogo kwa show ya ingia kwa ile ya hotel. Okay. Tunaona yani kwa sana kwa hiyo swali. kwanza ningeza sana yani kutoa shukurani kwa kila partner kwa shughuli ya utembe, media, of course my fans, kwa na kikweli kazi inaonekana na tumetoa kijana anaitwa Iani anafanya poa sana uh, fra yetu kama management sometimes ni ushike mtu mmoja afike point ya kujieza yani point anaweza kapia ugali kwa meza aweze pia kusaidia maybe family uko nyuma so point tumefika yani tunampeleka hiyo zone zone yenye pia anaweza jisimamia Um, anaweza pia jisimamia kikazi au ni vile kazi zake zinaenda so uh, after amefika hiyo point tutatambulisha msanii mwingine na uh, pia uh, maybe umeuliza story ya msanii wa kike yes of course uh, msanii wa kike ni mtu anataka pia attention si ati ni mtu utamhandle <laughs> rais so lazima uh, lazima tufanye research na tukue pia ready ze kuleta msanii wa kiko mbona lakini tuko share iko iko kwa plan yeah. wow thank you so much uh, our boy thank you so much ali kiba thank you so much aiden felix asateni sana kwa niaba for all the sponsors and the partners that is ziki media odi afrovasha ora homes lake naivasha resort superior hotel We would like to say a very big thank you and we look forward to seeing you in Lake Naivasha Resort Garden tomorrow and on Sunday as we do our first and a very big Afrobasha festival which we plan to be having it uh, twice in a year. Asante sana na mungu wabariki. So we'll take a group photo hapa, ninyo nataka picha and then kuna wale tulikuwa tumeahidia interview tafadhali tutasimama pale alafu tutaingia asante okay.